Hello. 안녕하세요. Manaso Pangavayo. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> How are you? Uh, kind of nervous. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> All right. So, ah, here we go. Hello. Hi. Hi, Katie. I'm going to introduce to each other, then I will get out. Sure. Okay. 안녕. Hello. 이름이 뭐야? Okay. <laughs> 이름 uh, 뭐야? 제 이름 Katie예요. Okay. Uh, 내 이름 Linda예요. So, 이름이 뭐예요? What is your mm. name? My name is Don. Don? Don? All right. Oh, yeah. English name? Korean name too. Same. Oh, I okay. Like it. It's very pretty. Ah, right. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, do you know where, 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 Um, 영어로 놀려고 만났지. <웃음> 그치? <웃음> right. 자, 오늘, 오케이. Okay. 캐리 선생님하고 캐리 선생님이 영어로, 오케이. Okay. 우리 조금 질문할 거야. 그러면 아는 대로 그냥 큰 소리로 대답해 주면 되고, 그리고 안 들리면, excuse me 라고 얘기해서 다시 선생님한테 물으면 돼. 할수 있겠어? Can you do that? So, if you have any questions, then you just raise your hand and you say, excuse me, but excuse I will me. also, like, yes, but I will also understand you if you go, chogio, chogio. or excuse me. Those okay. are both chogio okay. Chogio 해도 돼. Okay. 만약에 잘 모르겠으면, chogio, 이렇게 하던지, 아니면, excuse me, 이렇게 얘기하면. 알겠지? Then, all right. So, 질문 있어? 선생님은 나가고, 외국인 선생님하고 이제 얘기할 거야. 질문 있어요? Do you have any question? No? Okay. So, 그러면 우리 재밌게 얘기해봐. Okay. Katie, thank you. Sure. <laughs> All right. So, like I said, my name is Katie, right? Um, if calling me by my first name makes you uncomfortable, you can call me Tutor Katie or Teacher Katie, right? But I am okay with you calling me just Katie. That is how American people do it. First name. All right. Okay. And let me see if I can pronounce your name again. It's uh, Gaon? Yes. Okay. All right. Awesome. Today, we are going to do a small assessment test. Nothing big. Right, just to see what your level is at so that I know where I need to teach you at, all right? Um, let's go through the basic ones first. Do you know the entire English alphabet? Like A, B, C, D? Yes, exactly. Do you know the whole thing? Yes. Can you say it out loud for me? To the end? Yes, ma'am. Um, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, mm -hmm. Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, mm -hmm. X, Y, and Z. Very good. All right. Can you count to 20 for me? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Good job. All right. Now I have some words here in America 
We call these CVC words. They are, well, if I can get them out of my box. <laughs> CVC words are basic English words that we use for everyday sentences. All right. Normally, they are about mm, three letters long to five letters long. Or actually, here, I could do this. Thought. Yep. Be. Do. To. Can. Park. Mom. Cat. Roy. He. You are doing so awesome. He ran. Oh, yes, I skipped one. Sorry. Went. Very good. And ran. Mm -hmm. Man. Girl. Friend. Dog. We. Fun. Up. On. Did, am, how, Dead. sit, sat, very good, well, had, mm -hmm. all, and they're, they're going to start to get a little more, two, Love are come for say play they the, the Good. get uh, there it goes him her. As, has, no, so, go. Yep, you are just doing so awesome. It, mm -hmm. this, okay, is, okay, here. Yes, ma'am. See at look my like I mm -hmm. uh yep uh or a good me you ball. House, bad, and in, in, yep. and last one was excellent. All right, so you have all your CVC words, right? and now we're going to do a little bit of sentence reading. Where did my phone go? Ah, okay. Okay. Mm, it might be hard to see this. Uh, let me see if I can. One second. I'll send it to myself and then I can open it up mm -hmm. okay i'll just read it to you that's fine all right our first sentence i'm going to read a sentence to you and then i am going to read out 
four different options, right? A, B, C, or D. And you will give me the letter of the option that is the correct answer, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, so it multiple choice. Like, like this. If I say, how old are you? Would you answer with this? Right? Or would you answer with this? And this is what I mean by you. I would say, A, I have 27 years old. B, I have 27 years. Right? Or until we get to the correct answer. And there will be, there will be four choices to choose from. Like the, uh, I get it. Okay. Okay. All right. So how old are you? A, I have 27 years old. B, I have 27 years. C, I am fine. D, I am 27 years old. D. Good job. Okay. Second question. He went to the stadium, A, with taxi, B, by taxi, C, on taxi, or D, in taxi. He went B. to the stadium. B. Uh, B? Did you say B or D? B. B, very good. Yes, he went to the stadium by taxi. Very good. All right. How long have you been living in London? A, for seven years. B, at least seven years. C, since seven years. D, seven years ago. C? Um, this one is... is kind of tricky. Um, I, the technical, technically the correct answer is for seven years, but that is not a complete sentence. And all four of these, well, not all four, for seven years, at least seven years, A and B are both correct. Um, C, if you say since seven years, you have to add the word ago to the end, which is why it is incorrect, okay? Uh, but both A and B are correct. So but that's okay. That one was a really tricky one. It was really tricky. Okay. We haven't got blank, right? So we haven't got, uh, and that's where you fill in the answer, money. All right, first option. We haven't got a lot money. We haven't got some money. We haven't got any money. We haven't got many money. D? Close. It's going to be C. We haven't got any money. Right? The more basic form of this sentence is we don't have. Right? Okay, so we don't have any money. We don't have a lot, but it needs of after, which is why the first one is not the correct answer. We don't have some money. 
right, is not correct either. So the only one is going to be C, any. We haven't got any money. All right, I am going to read four different sentences. You tell me which sentence is correct, right? which one has proper grammar, okay? He like going to the movies. He likes going to the movies. He liked go to the movies. He likes the movies. Oh, sorry. He, oh, no, sorry. He liked the movies. The second one. Uh, reset. He liked going to the movies. He second liked one. going to the movies. Very good. That is correct. All right, next one. Peter blank fly to San Francisco tomorrow. Peter to going fly to San Francisco tomorrow. Peter goes to fly to San Francisco tomorrow. Peter is going to fly to San Francisco tomorrow. Peter go to fly to San Francisco tomorrow. Yes going to very good all right he plays soccer on wednesdays in wednesdays at wednesdays by wednesdays on wednesdays very good okay Do you some more coffee? Do you like some more coffee? You'd like some more coffee? Would you like some more coffee? Would you like some more coffee? Yes, very good. All right. I wanted a green shirt but they only had a one white, one white, a white, a white one. A white? Yeah, so I wanted a green shirt, but they only had a one white. I wanted a green shirt, but they only had one white. I wanted a green shirt, but they only had a white. I wanted a green shirt, but they only had a white one. One white. Close, right? So earlier in the sentence, it says a green shirt, right? So they're indicating that there's just one. He wanted one shirt by a, saying a green shirt. So a green shirt is singular, that's one. But they only had, right? Now, if the store only had one white shirt, if there was only one shirt in the whole store that was white, you could say one white, right? But he's indicating a singular color. So it's a white one. And those can be very tricky. That's okay. All right, next one. He does never been to America. He has never been to America. He haven't never been to America. He hadn't never been to America. He hadn't, he has never been to America. Very good, yes. Correct. Okay. Okay, there we go. All right, last sentence. 
right, let's see. A Richard usually arrives late. So A, option A, Richard usually arrives late. B, Richard late arrives usually. C, Richard late usually arrives. Or D, Richard usually late arrives. Richard usually arrives late. Very good. Okay, sorry. And then the last sentence. I thought that was the last one, but it's not. The house was empty. There, blank, there. There wasn't nobody there. There was anybody there. There was somebody there. There was nobody there. There was nobody there. Very good. All right. Good job. Okay, our assessment test is over. All right. Your reading level is is good. I think that um, I don't have to put you at the very basic level uh, with some of the other kids. I believe you can start reading small chapter books and doing fun vocabulary games. Um, and your pronunciation skills are very excellent. Very excellent. All right, give yourself a pat on the back, Gon. It was very good. You did well. All right. Our assessment is over. Um, I'm going to let Miss Linda have the, the room back. And Hello. Hi, Katie. Yeah. Hi. Thank, you. Thank you so much. Uh, okay. 어머니, 그러면 줌 옮겨서 어머님하고 얘기할게요. So, 네. 아, 네. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> 감사합니다. 다음에 Thank you. 선생님한테 클로징 인사할 수 있어? Have a great day. 미국은 지금 아침이야. 그러니까, okay, have a great day 해줄 수 있어? Have a great day. Yeah. Uh, and you as well. You have a great day too. <laughs> Bye. Love you.